Start Design Concept. And on this video, I'm going to be showing you how to come up with your design of your waffle slab and wheat slab, okay, on total structure. Uh, if this is the first time you are watching any of my videos, I've done a lot of designs on RCD printer, RCC spreadsheet, photo card, around and a complete design on portal structure. I've done designs on architecture, mechanical and electrical service drawings, structural designs and detailing. Okay. Um, now to come up with your uh, slab here, uh, I'm going to use three different slabs here. I'm going to use uh, the uh, the solid slab, the rib slab, and then the waffle slab. Okay, so as to demonstrate and give you a better insight on how to come up with your design on total um, structure uh, as you can see here click on slab look at the fashion ok you can use any of these arrows with John John the arrows the coin ok if I click on beam region it will click to select around the area of this beams okay as you can see click on axis okay we have an axis here we have one here we have one here and then we have one here okay I'm going to use axis region and then um, my thickness is 150 Okay, concrete cover 25. Let's that. Okay. Um, I'm going to click on rib slab. Okay. On rib. Um, now, I will advise you to lay your hands on RCD uh, simplified reinforced concrete design uh, by Victor Oyenula, or you can get one by Mosley and Bongi, or get any that is recommended in your country, okay? Uh, so as to have a better insight on how to come up with your design. Okay? And the breadth of the well, I'm going to use um, 150. Uh, the height I'm going to use 400. Um, the height of slab 400. Uh, sorry, height of slab 100. Okay. And then the block 400. Okay. Then this this slab is actually a square. Um, like you know, wheat and uh, waffle slab are actually uh, used where you have um, uh, a very large span, okay, of slab, okay. Uh, for example, like um, the shopping mall, okay, uh, where you have large span, okay. And maybe uh, a column is actually not required at the middle. Okay, uh, you provide a waffle slab or a rib slab. Okay, I'm going to take you through that of a waffle slab. Okay, on this rib, I'm going to make use of this, and then uh, um, I'm going to click. Uh, you can see that's provide my ribs. Okay, and then uh, to design for for waffle, I'm going to 
is this green okay and then i'm going to maintain all of this here I'll click. okay um the next thing i'm going to do here is to uh use my script okay um, on my script um, i'm going to use analytical strip for my solid slab um i'm having a pin there is a pin here so i'm going to click here at the start point um i want to stop uh, this here okay i'm not going to use it as a continuous beam it's not continuous so it's stopping here okay so if i click here at my start uh, i'm going to click here as my end okay it ends with a beam starts with a beam ends with a beam okay hope you understand that uh, and then i'm going to click drag and then hold on control key okay and drop As you can see here it has returned my reinforcement here it has returned my reinforcement here please neglect this while it i just i'm just trying to illustrate what is happening here okay um like if you have been following me i've done designs on quota structure where i explain how you can change your reinforcement okay and specify reinforcement that are required in your or that are customary in your country okay and i'm not going to speak you through that today um now my script uh for this i'm going to change this to fe script as element okay so um for this as you can see um for my script here let's change it to m um um i'm actually going to start Starting in a slab, okay. So I'm going to pick this. That's my start. This is my start, okay. Uh, and I'm dropping at a slab as well, okay. So I'm going to also pick. Uh, I'm going to maintain my FE starting in a slab and then I'm ending it in a beam. Uh oh sorry, I made a mistake on this. Uh -huh. I'm going to do that strip. Sorry for that mistake, please. So I'm starting in this slab and then I'm um, ending it in this slab. 
Okay. So I'm going to hold on this. I'm going to hold on control. Then I drop. Correct now. And that of the waffle. I'm starting with a slab. Okay. And the beam. Okay. Then to drop. Hold on control. And drop. Okay. Um, that is it about my my waffle. Okay, but here now, as you can see, this slab here is a two-way slab, right? Uh, I can strip on this other side too. I'm starting with the thing. Okay, it ends with the thing. My job. Okay. So that is that. Um, the next thing I'm going to show you is to go to your Bennett uh, law analysis, Bennett elements law analysis. to click on flow mesh analysis okay while it's load if you love what you're seeing already why not give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel okay it's actually free you see a red button down below click on that red button and you are subscribed okay click on the bell icon to get a notification whenever i post videos i post videos like this on a weekly sometimes on a daily so as to encourage as many that are trying to come up in designs okay um down the description of this video with, um, my uh, youtube channel is actually the link to my channel is there you can go to that channel and keep yourself busy have a lot of videos there already for you uh, have uh, 40 videos available on that channel that you can uh, keep you well engaged okay um, you can chat me up on my whatsapp contact is there on my description box okay and then chat me or follow me on any of those social media platforms and I will do well to um, to reply okay um, I'm going to Thank you. 
to um, my concrete design, go to my reefs, have analysis. Okay, you can see here it's telling us that it has to be right. I'm going to interactive uh, design. I'm done with this design, okay? I'm going to put a put a detail. Let's see our detail point on this one. Right now, what I'm going to do is to go to my design library, and then I'll go to um, detail library. Sorry, section. Then I'll hold on this. Hold on my control. Thank you. 